Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Shimori Lockdown Series. So we got uh, some cold weather and we got some windy weather, which just isn't helping when I'm trying to film off of a cell phone. So what I'm going to do today is I've put a whole bunch of interesting clips together on how many times I've nearly lost a GoPro or just interesting times animals have uh, walked up to the camera and smelt it. And one or two interesting times of when I've gone out and seen an animal and filmed it. Uh, there's a, a little clip of a serval here uh, from quite a while ago, but uh, I happened to be driving past and saw the serval and I had was the GoPro with me. I got out and filmed, which was at quite a distance and I went closer and closer. And, and she just accepted me and I carried on filming her until we were virtually next to one another and uh, just completely accepted the fact that I was there. I filmed, she carried on doing what she was doing naturally, which was hunting and uh, until we just parted ways. So some amazing experiences. Uh, <laughs> I've had to replace some equipment, but uh, it's uh, it's all led to some incredible footage so i hope you enjoy it i hope you all stay safe and we over halfway through it keep safe sometimes one of the best ways to observe animals is to just put a camera down turn it on and just leave and uh, what you'll see is just animals behaving in their completely natural behavior without any human influence at all the zebra over here just carrying on at the waterhole, interacting on a social level, and they don't even know the camera's there. Ended up building a foam duck over a radio controlled speedboat that my GoPro could go in just to get an interesting perspective of what the hippos see, their, their viewpoint from water level. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Stay safe and we'll see you soon.